What are your thoughts on the earth being round yet being like a frisbee style, flat and round at the same time? Is that is that what you think? You know, like the flat earth map that you can see? With mm -hmm. the, do you believe in the ice wall? Yes, I believe that there's an art the Antarctic ice wall, and I like to think of Earth as the Antarctic basin. Mm. The the Earth that we live on, the little Earth ponds, think of it as a giant lake. The continents are islands in that lake, and Antarctica is the shoreline. So when people say, "Well, why can't you just fall off the edge?" You know, you see the memes and things like that. Well, you can't fall off a lake. You go to the shoreline, and then what's beyond that? We don't know. Yeah, that's a really good answer. So does that help people? You know, you, Tommy's answering all of these questions. Uh, right, if the earth is flat, if the earth is flat, what is underneath and how deep is it? So the deepest anyone's ever drilled down is the borehole in Russia, which was eight miles down, or the Mariana Trench. Um, they went down to 7.8 miles right there. So everything beyond that is just speculation because we don't know what's down there. Now, they say in the globe model that the magnetic field comes from the core of the Earth. But the problem with that is, is that it's over 7,000 degrees in the globe model at the core of the Earth. Now, there's a thing called the Curie point in which metals lose their ability to produce a magnetic field. And the Curie point, they say the Earth's core is made of iron and nickel. Well, nickel loses its um, magnetism at a little over 700 degrees, it's somewhere around 700 degrees Fahrenheit. And then it's around 1400, I believe, for iron. So the, you cannot, these metals cannot produce the magnetic field in their model. But that's something they never address. Now, do we know what's down there? No, it would just be pure speculation. Yeah, I think the, the ocean has always intrigued me, like I say more than space and everything else. They seem to distract us with space and, what's on the moon and, and all these other things and yet we haven't even been to the, the deepest part of our own oceans we've only been to part of it and also the you know the arctic the the antarctic treaty is another one that you've got to wonder why we're not allowed to go there um so we've got we've got a random question here so it's got nothing to do with flat earth but I, i'm going to go with it uh where's it gone now it was what was your favorite movie i'm trying to find it now. i'm trying to find who asked that Oh, my favorite movie. all the time so i should have uh, put slime with them i don't know i watch a lot of foreign films yeah. so I'm, I'm, you I'm, say porn oh foreign <laughs> foreign foreign films yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah okay I, I don't really have a favorite i just got a, a lot of movies that i enjoy <laughs> do you like horror i do like horror and um science fiction yeah and me same, same, similar to what I like. Are all of your friends in America then? All of your flat earth friends? No, actually, uh, I have um, flat earth friends in, one of them's in the chat now, he's from Germany. Um, I have flat earth friends all over Europe and in England. I uh, oh, right. support the, the Globe Live Tour. You know, they drove all over the, Europe last year, all over England and stopped in a different city every day for what was seven or 8,000 miles they covered and just kept stopping in a different city every day, get out on the streets and talk to people about truth. So yes, I have oh, a lot of friends outside the U S as well. 